Now cauliflower can be a bit tricky to grow in Western Australia because it only thrives in cooler weather. But if done right, trust me, it's worth it. And today I'm gonna to show you how to turn the humble cauliflower into a roasted satay cauliflower steak dish. So let's get started. First things first, we're gonna prep our cauliflower. And to do that, I'm gonna take off these green kind of leaves, just breaking them off. I'm cutting lengthways about two to three centimeters thick. I have a baking dish here, which I'm just gonna add a little bit of oil. Add these cauliflower steaks in, making sure they're nicely spread out. A bit more oil and to season, I've got some garlic and onion powder, as well as some chili powder. just a bit of salt to season. So now that's seasoned, it's gonna go straight into my oven that has been preheating at 200 degrees for about 20 to 30 minutes or until golden and crisp. So now my cauliflower steaks are roasting away. I'm gonna show you how to make a really simple satay sauce. So I have here with me some red curry paste. I've just got a pan here on low heat. To that, I'm adding some sweet soy sauce, some sriracha, and a great in a little bit of garlic. We've got some coconut milk. I'm adding in some natural peanut butter, but I prefer smooth, so straight in. A little bit of water to help loosen the sauce and a Tahitian lime from the garden. I know it looks like lemon, but this is a Tahitian lime. So I'm gonna add some of that in to balance out the flavor. I'm gonna give that a good mix, bring that up to a gentle simmer, let it cook for about three to five minutes and thicken slightly. For you guys at home, what I would say is to just make sure it's a pouring consistency. Uh, in terms of cooking, it doesn't take long at all. But if you look at that there, I'm quite happy with that. All right, well, I reckon let's check on our cauliflower steaks and we're gonna bring this whole dish together. So my cauliflower is nice and hot. I'm gonna let that rest just for a minute or so whilst I prep my toppings. I have some roasted peanuts, which I'm just gonna chop up. I have some spring onion as well, just to add some freshness. Some coriander leaves and some fried shallots. There you have it guys, my roasted satay cauliflower steaks. Give this a go at home. It's a great plant-based alternative to your classic steak.